You know, when you get out there, it's a, it's a completely different, it's a completely different thing. It's a sort of surreal moment because you, you know, I've been here all weekend and you watch drummer after drummer go out and play great, and then suddenly it's your turn and you're out there, kind of, you know, in front of a, an audience, and time seems to change. It's like some sort of out-of-body experience. Um, I enjoyed it. I was very relaxed. Um, uh, you know, I enjoyed it. I, you know, you always think you could have played better, but did the best I could at the time. I mean, if Modern Drummer asks you or invites you to come play the Modern Drummer Festival, who's going to say no? <laughs> I mean, this is... How does it get any better? Yeah, I mean, the kit I'm using is a Sona SQ2. It's the thin vintage shells, which means they're four ply with the, with the rings on the top and the bottom. It's a golden madrone finish. I use uh, Remo Emperors on the tops of the toms and Remo Clear Ambassadors on the bottom. Um, of course, I have you know Zildjian cymbals. Uh, I have like a, you know a 16 inch china. I have five chimes, bell chimes. I don't know what to call them. I actually made them myself from broken cymbals, and then Zildjian has made me some subsequently. I have a, an 18 inch um, Crash of Doom, I have a couple of custom Crash Bells that we've been making prototypes of, a 15 inch K, 20 inch K Ride, an 18 inch K Crash, 12 inch Oriental China Trash and an 18 inch Z China. Um, you know, I use Vic Firth sticks, the, the, the rock model, the Hickory rock model. I'm using Axis bass drum pedals, um, pure sound snares. Uh, you know, there's some stuff that you don't see, like Hardcase, uh, you know, Dave Ayer at Hardcase. And um, sometimes I use the S hoops too. Well, I'd like to thank all the people who, um, you know, support me with the equipment, the guys from Sono, Zildjian. Remo, Vic Firth, uh, Axis, uh, all the guys I've just listed basically. And um, you know, I'd like to thank the, the, the modern drummer readers who voted for me uh, in the readers poll for the progressive rock drummer of uh, 2008 and 2007. And uh, I'd like to thank Bill Miller for being the one who invited me to come.